Hey, what's up guys, it's Arabian Gains, and today we're right here at Echo Park in Los Angeles, California. I'm gonna show you how this beautiful park turned to a homeless encampment park. So, let's take a look and let's take a walk. All right, it's a beautiful day here at this park. Oh, we just walked in. A tent right there, another tent. Oh, there's a few of them. All right, look at this beautiful big birds. That's a lot of protein right there. See right here, you could come in and bring your family and you guys could play with these. It's beautiful, but now there's a dark side right here, like right in front of me. There's a lot of homeless tents right here, homeless encampments. This goes around all this park. So if I'm standing right here, you guys can see this across the street. Way out there, there's tents. So let's look right here. It's, it's a beautiful park. Regardless to all these tents. You can bring your family right here and play, rent one of those right there, those little boats, what do they call them, pedal boat boats. But look, there's a lot of encampments right here. And um, Los Angeles uh, has probably a lot of, oh look at this kitty. Los Angeles has a, a huge population of homeless. And this problem is just spreading. A lot of people think it's only by the bridge or in a Venice area, Venice Beach area. No, it's actually all over. This is just a fraction of what you guys see. So right here is Echo Park and pretty much in uh, Los Angeles County, every park you see, it has a homeless encampment in it. I know people come right here to fish but this is not safe right now it looks like this but if you talk to the people who usually come to this park a lot they'll tell you once the sun goes down these homeless have their own party right here they have fights and they do everything that they want to do of course no consequences I mean it's all tents it's pretty much you have a tent on the lake. It's like a, basically one of those houses on the lake. I know in California, if I want to get me a house on the lake, that's going to be at least five hundred, six hundred thousand dollars. But right here, now nah, you could get that free. It's crazy, huh? Look. And it gets even more. It's like a lake house. For free. Look at this trash. Oh, they have their own garden. Wow. Wow, all right. You have your own garden going on. Look right here, on this side there's more. There's a front porch right here. Wow. So if we look right here, there's a lot. This is just ridiculous. Look at this guy right there, have wood. He's probably planning on building a house right here. I mean, why not? Our tax money is right here covering everybody for free. You might as well just, yeah, build a house, build a mansion. The taxpayers got you. Look, it's a lot of, uh, this is not clean at all. It's 
I mean, some people are here selling, trying to make a living. That's good. I support anybody that trying to make an honest living. You know, you, you're down your luck. You live in a tent right here and you work and try to get out of the street. That's good. But what about that percentage that they want to do drugs and party and basically not do anything? If you look right here, see there's a power line. So there's electricity right from that pole. So if you look, oh, I'm gonna go right here between. They're probably gonna get mad at me. See electricity line running all the way. See the power line? This thing running all the way. Wow, this is hazard right there. This is right here, a fire is waiting to happen. A huge fire, where's the the Lake County Police or Health Department or Safety, whatever they call them. Damn, look in there. Oh, he has a TV inside. A goddamn TV. Oops. Wow, look. More power, more electricity. More, see that? It's all over the place. Uh, I think I pissed somebody off. They're kind of looking at me right now. Wow. Look at this. Yeah. You okay? What? You recording? Yeah, I'm recording. This is a public park, so I'll, I'll record. Have a good day. This is not your private property. You don't own it. Have a go sue me. Have a good day. Have a good day. A good day. Wow. All right. So right here. All right. Go ahead, sue me. Wow. The audacity they have right here. This is a public park, and I want a video. People talk about suing me. <laughs> good luck. You bring your family right here to enjoy this beautiful park. She's still yelling, talking about how this is her right. Well, you crossed my path as I'm videoing. You didn't have to come in front of the camera. But she wanted to come back and talk about this is her right. This is not your private property. Uh, this is a public area, taxpayers like me. And I'm videoing right here. The audacity these people have to talk about suing somebody for videoing. Good luck. So it's overall, it's a, it was a way better park before the pandemic, of course, but now it got even worse and worse. Uh, I know the shelters, they're not 100% full, but a lot of these people, they don't want to go to the shelters. Like, you're not going to get a lake view from the shelter. There's no shelter that's going to give you a lake view. And the shelters, they have basically a curfew. You have to be home by 8, I mean, you have to be in a shelter by 8 or something like that, and you have to get up in the morning. Some of these guys want to sleep in. And I know there's some problems. What if you're a homeless and you're in a shelter, and you have a, a night shift. So you go to work from eight to four in the morning. Then as soon as you get back to the shelter, they tell you basically pack up and leave because they don't want anybody there during the day. So that's an issue there too. So it's a big problem, I understand. But this problem needs to be resolved, not by people like me. Oh, there's some trash right there. This problem needs to be resolved, not, not from people like me or you. It needs politicians to step in, officials, health department. I can't do anything because a lot of people say, well, you're just videoing. Uh, why don't you have a solution to the problem? I don't have a solution to this problem. This is the, the entire United States problem. I can't solve the entire United States problem. This needs actually somebody to step in from health officials and so on and city and politicians and solve this. There's no way I could solve something like this. This is just all the people who leave those hate comments. 
So this is what COVID did to this park. And actually some of them were here before COVID. I'm not blaming COVID 100%, but uh, as you've seen guys, like these guys have even electricity line power. That is not safe. I mean, like, I don't care if you're stealing uh, electricity, do what you gotta do to have your TV so you can watch, you know, WWE or the Kim Kardashian show, do what you gotta do, but have it a little bit safer. You could tell like the wires were exposed and I know it's been raining here. Maybe just not enough water hit that line. Again, I'm not an electrician, but I could tell it does not look safe whatsoever. I know if uh, there's a fire about to happen, it's for their own safety. These guys don't understand. It's for their own safety. They should not have this. But this goes to show that we take a lot of stuff for granted that these people don't have what we have. But this is the park right here, if you guys look. Beautiful lake. It's real beautiful. Echo Park. Look at it. And uh, it's a huge park, believe me. I thought I was gonna be able to walk this entire park in a few minutes, but from the looks of it, it's gonna be a long video. All right. More. I didn't know that I was gonna come here and uh, get a cardio done. Look. I mean, I feel bad for some of the people. I mean, some people are here homeless. They're trying to actually make a living. They're trying to sell something. And there's some of them just want to get high. So this is the playground. I don't know how, I don't know. I don't have kids. I have stepkids, but they're already grown. But I don't know anybody with little kids would bring them right here to play at the ground with homeless being all over, basically. I mean, I wouldn't. But it's not safe. I'm not saying these homeless are bad, but you never know. You never know anything nowadays. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Look, these people right here, hard workers. They want to make a living. Look right there. Oh, there's another homeless encampment that far that I didn't see. Wow. Well, I hope you guys are. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. And uh, I'll be doing more vlogs in the future about other parks here in Los Angeles County or Orange County, wherever I find homeless encampments. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Make sure you comment, like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in the future vlogs or other videos.